Hi, this is James. Now, are you looking for a tool that is going to boost the conversions of your visitors to your pages and websites? I've got great news. Provely is launching on 22nd March 2022 at 11 a.m. Eastern. I've got a quick walkthrough of Provely, and I'm going to show you the seven benefits that you derive when you use Provely to boost conversions on your websites and web pages. And stick around till the end as I will reveal a coupon that you can use to knock down the price by $50. Before that, check out this quick demo of Proofly. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how easy it is to integrate a Provely widget notification onto your website. So the first thing you're gonna do is click on new notification. You're going to give it a name. So let's just say that uh, I want to uh, generate more signups to my webinar. So I'm gonna say webinar registration, and then I'm going to put in the domain that it's going to um, be on. So I'm just gonna put that in click create, and then it's going to send you into the wizard. So now you can see we have uh, a whole bunch of different uh, notifications. Uh, we're going to be adding more in the future. So maybe when you're watching this video, there will be actually more, but um, depending on what your goal is, uh, you're going to choose which notification you want. So if you want to have a live conversion, so when someone signs up for, um, you know, for an opt-in form or when someone purchases, you'll use the live conversion. We also have integrations with third-party rating services. So if you want to pull in those ratings and reviews um, from from Google from Facebook uh, from Captera you're able to do that um, we also have the ability to show the number of visitors onto uh, on a certain page or on your website that are currently browsing we also have a an announcement so if you want people to opt into uh, an ebook or anything that you want to kind of highlight you can use our our announcement notification then we also have a countdown timer. So if you have a time sensitive offer, maybe you're running a special during a holiday, you're able to highlight that. Then we have our social notification widget. So this is if you want to generate more Facebook followers or, or Twitter followers or Instagram followers or LinkedIn, um, you're able to highlight your social media properties. Then we also have coupons. So maybe you have a time sensitive coupon, you want them to be able to apply it. Um, this is great for um, you know maybe people who have come to the page a couple times, haven't converted. Um, you're able to use that coupon. Then we have our video notification. So you're able to embed a Vimeo or YouTube video right onto your widget and have it display at a certain time. Then we have our opt-in. So if you want to build your newsletter or your email list, you're able to use that notification. Then we also have this chat widget. So this can be a simulated chat where uh, your the goal is to capture their phone number. So maybe you're doing some, some sort of sales or you wanna follow up with them via phone, you're able to capture their phone number and be able to follow, follow up with them. Then we also have the inline notification. So this would be just pure text. You're able to embed it right into uh, your page. So maybe uh, you're trying to to sell uh, hotel rooms or you have a certain number of, of vehicles on the lot that you need to sell and you could say you know there are you know x number of of vehicles left right or there are uh, three hotel rooms left at this price so there's lots of different ways that you can utilize provably notifications depending on what your goals are uh, for this for this demo i'm just going to use the live conversion which is uh, what most people use but again there are lots of different options so once you've done that, we're just confirming the domain that it's going to live on. And then we have lots of different uh, um, display options as well as audio options. And uh, so we're going to run through those. So the first thing is, do I want to show uh, the map thumbnail? Do I want to do a custom avatar? Do I want to add a custom image right here? You're able to do that. Maybe you want to use your logo or, or an icon. You're able to do that. And then we have lots of different theme settings. So you can choose from one of our pre-built uh, pre-designed themes, uh, lots of different options to choose from. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and use this one. Then you can choose what you want your location format to be. Do I want it to be just the city? Do I want it to be the country? Do I want to show the city and the country? Do I want to show um, the timestamp? Uh, do I want to display real names or not? Do I want to show an avatar or not? Then you can also add sound effects as well. So you could have different sound effects um, that just kind of give that audible uh, alert to your visitor or customer uh, to just kind of say, hey, you know, pay attention to this notification. Uh, we also have the animation effects. So you can use uh, bounce effects or flash effects. We have lots of different ones that you can choose. 
And then you could also uh, add some custom CSS. So if you want to have it match, you know, your branding, maybe you have a certain font or a certain type of design that you want to have this widget, you can use custom CSS uh, and you can add it right into there. Then you have your, uh, your message. We can say like live webinar coming um, this Thursday, right? And then you could have your font uh, weight, you could have your font size, uh, you can choose what font family you want, message uh, positioning, and then uh, what what text you want. So this is the text that's going to show, you know, recently signed up for a 14-day free trial. So I could say recently signed up for the upcoming webinar, right? And then I could change the text color if I want to as well. So let's just say I want to go with the purple. And now we're going to do the actual widget itself. So if I want to add a border, I can do that. So I could do something like this and... Um, I could add that. So here's my colors and maybe I want to do an orange border and I could change the radius if, if I wanted to. Um, I could add a gradient, I could add a background color so I can change all the different elements that are on the widget notification. Now let's talk about display settings. So uh, do I want it to show up on the desktop versus a tablet versus mobile? So one thing that you may find you know kind of annoying is when you're on a mobile device, obviously the phone is much smaller than your desktop browser and um, you know it, it can take up a lot of real estate on someone's phone. So what you may wanna do is turn it off for mobile notifications um, and only have it show up on your desktop and tablet. So you have that control. And you also have the control as to where it's gonna show on um, the browser itself. So do I want bottom left, bottom right, top left, top right? You're able to do that. Then you could choose, um, when should it display? So you can set a delay. So once the person lands on the page, do I want to show it five seconds, maybe 30 seconds, a minute after they have um, been on the page? Then the display frequency. So how often should it display? Should it show up every five seconds? Should it show up every 10 seconds? Um, so it'll rotate through each of the different opt-ins or, or um, whatever the goal is for that notification. Notifications per user session. So you do have the ability to limit the number of times that the notification is displaying. So you could have no limit or you can set a custom limit. So maybe I only want it to show five or 10 times and maybe after a certain number of times it may get a bit intrusive to the customer or visitor. Then you could have the date range. So um, do I want to only display opt-ins or customers uh, or leads from you know the last 30 days, the last hour? Um, and then you know, do I want it to only show up after there's a certain number of visitors? So maybe you don't want to have, you know, if there's only one person that's opted in so far, maybe you don't want it to show up. But once you have, you know, three, five, ten, then you can have it start to rotate through and it shows, you know, it starts to inject that scarcity and that um, that kind of fear missing out, right? Then you have the uh, country display. So maybe you only want to, maybe you cater to only people in the US or people in Canada or, or Europe. You're able to select which countries you want to display. And then also, do I want it to display on all pages? So I could either have it display on one page, I could have it display on all pages, it's completely up to you. And then if you have upgraded to um, our agency edition, you're able to remove the branding from the widget. So it'll allow you to remove the verified or powered by Provely. Uh, so um, you can remove that as well. Now let's talk about the data source and integration. So we have a lot of different ways we can pull in data into your, your notification. So the first one, and, and probably what's used most often, is the web capture or action. So this is a little piece of script you add to your page, and we can automatically recognize when someone is filling out a form. So regardless of if you're using you know, WordPress or using maybe a plugin or using Wix or ClickFunnels or some page builder, you can add this form to your, uh, or add this script onto your page, and we're automatically gonna be able to recognize the, the, the from name as well as the from email address and then be able to display that um, onto your notifications. We also have um, an API. So if you want to utilize our API in some sort of custom integration, you're able to do that. And we also have webhooks. So um, we, we have some uh, limited number of webhook integrations with things like Pay Kickstart, ClickFunnels, Shopify, um, but we're adding more as we move forward. And so um, whenever a webhook is fired, it can get sent over into Provely and it'll be able to add them to the notifications. And then the last part is the embed. So you're gonna have just a simple script that you'll add to the body tag of, of your page, and this is just going to allow it to display the notification onto, um, onto your page, okay? So once I've done that, all I need to do is click Publish, and it's going to add it. Uh, let me just go ahead and click here, and it's going to add it on, um, uh, it's going to then display onto your page. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip over, and I'm going to add the scripts, and I'll show you how it displays on the page.
Okay, so for this example, I'm just going to use WordPress. I actually installed a plugin called header and footer. So it allows me to add um, JavaScript uh, into uh, a certain page. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to say webinar reg uh, for Provely. And this is a JavaScript code. And uh, instead of site wide, I'm going to actually select the specific page that I want to add this to. So I'm going to first add in the tracking script. And then I'm going to add in the display script. So that's been copied and now I'm going to add that. So now um, I want to make sure that it's um, uh, after content. So this is going to add it at the bottom of the page. So these are the two pieces of script one. So the first one is again, just um, being able to capture the user's information. And then the second one is displaying the actual notification onto the page. So I'm going to save it. And now I'm going to go over to my page. Okay. And so here's my uh, webinar opt-in page. And I'm just going to put in a name. I'm just going to put in use first name for now. And then I'm going to put in a email address. Okay. And I'm going to click on register. All right. Then it shows my uh, my re my thank you page. And so now what I can do is go back over to Provely. And I can see in the activity manager that I just had that opt-in. So it shows the, the opt-in, shows the IP address shows um, the email address and when it happened. So now when I go back over to my webinar registration page, so as you can see, uh, just here a second, there it goes. Now the pop-up is showing the notifications and it's really just that simple to add Provely to your site. All right, guys. So I hope that quick demo of Provely was useful for you and has shown you how you can use this tool to boost conversions of those who land on your pages and all websites. Now, as I go through the sales page, I want you to take note of the notifications that are appearing at the bottom of the screen, bottom left of the screen, as you can see here. So these are all examples of the notifications that are being used on the Provely sales page itself. Now, first thing that you will note is that this is Provely 2.0. So this is the updated version of the original product launched more than five years ago or about five years ago. Now, from the demo, you know that Provely is a tool that is going to skyrocket your sales or even other types of conversions that you are looking for because it adds real-time social proof, scarcity, urgency, and credibility to your website. One of the first things you notice is that Provely, since its launch, has been used by 20,000 plus websites to convert visitors. And if you look at some of these names, they are big names like Doodly and Videos. And therefore, this is the first benefit. You can rest assured that it has been used and the lessons over the last five years has been used to update to Provely 2.0. Now, benefit number two is that this is a typo. It is not 12. It is 13 notification types are available. In the demo, it was 11 that were revealed. So these are the 13 that you get. Live conversions, low stock, urgency, timer, reviews, live visitors, inline text, announcement, callback, social, coupon, video, and opt-in. So that's great because with one tool, this is benefit number two, you save costs instead of using a multitude of tools for all these functions, you just stick with Proofly. Now, benefit number three is that you can, use, you can mix and match the notification types. Now, benefit number four is that you can integrate with your existing websites and other apps as well, and have a look at the list here. And benefit number five is that it works with any type of page builder, including WordPress. Now, if you compare Provely with its competitors, either Proof or FOMO, you will notice that the other two have high monthly payment plans, whereas with Provely, it's a low one-time price, so save money and it comes with unlimited visitors. So it leaves the competitors in the dust. And I'm going to be revealing the price to you in a moment. 
So you have an option of picking up either the basic, the pro, or the ultimate. And for all three, it's a one-time payment plan. And for the ultimate, which has unlimited everything, including top priority support and notification streams, it is $197, but use the coupon code 50 off to knock it down to $147 one time. So guys, I just wanted to show you the FAQs and just pick up on a couple of things which I think are important for you to note. This is probably an important question for you. Will it impact your page load times? Not at all, not in any way. And also note that there is no visitor limit and note that there is a 30 day money back guarantee, which is a satisfaction based guarantee. Now, the final benefit, benefit number seven, is that you would have noticed from the demo, as well as going through the sales page here, that you don't need to install Proofly on any of your devices. You can use whatever device that you have to access Proofly from anywhere in the world as it is online. So, guys, there is a launch party that is taking place. In fact, there are two. So, the party starts Monday, 21st of March at 8 p.m. Eastern, where a webinar, Mark is running a webinar. So jump in on that webinar. And there is an on-call on March 22nd at 10 a.m. Eastern. That's an hour before the cart opens. So jump in on this webinar, register for the webinar. And the way you get to this page is by clicking on the link below this video where you will land on my bonus page where I reveal the bonuses that I've lined up for you when you pick up Proofly through me. Now, when you're on the bonus page, just click on the button and all the link at the bottom of the page and you will land on this registration page. Provided you do this before 10 a.m. of Tuesday, March 22nd and or Monday, March 21st, 8 p.m. So there you go, guys. I hope that quick walkthrough and demo of Proofly has shown to you how you can use this tool to boost conversions of those who visit your websites and or your pages. And I wish you great success with Proofly.